sorry to pick myself up but i actually outdone myself with this haul amazing the rope can we just it looks like a scarf you see hello and welcome back to my channel today i'm coming at you with a huge sheen haul i feel like i've been waiting for ages to film this video the order took a little bit longer than usual to arrive but hey here we are now and i have got the best bits to show you I'm not even being biased either. I found the best summary pieces. We're gonna have outfits for pub gardens, four nights out, drinks nights, holidays, and also festivals as well. If you are new here, then please do subscribe. It would mean the world to me. And let's just get on with the video. And the first piece I want to show you, I'm actually already wearing because I couldn't wait to put it on. It is this little crisscross, strappy little top here i really don't know what you would describe it as i think they had it on as like a halter neck crisscross style bandeau crop top by the way i am going to be showing all these pieces in outfits in a separate try on clip as well just so you can see how i'd style them what the overall vibe would be if you put them together as an outfit anyway this is the first top i absolutely love it i think it's so perfect for spring summer festivals pub gardens this is so versatile you could literally wear it anywhere i have seen a lot of people wear very similar style tops but i just had to get my own because you can literally wear it in so many different ways it just completely depends how you want to wear it it is kind of just like a straight bandeau at the back and then it ties up the front here the material is certainly not the thickest i don't think it's see-through to the point like you can't wear it like you can't see any color underneath or nipple or anything like that but then what can you expect this top was about five pounds okay and to pair with this top i actually picked up these brown leggings brown trousers I'm pretty sure as soon as I have them on you'll know what I mean you kind of put them on as normal leggings trousers and then you just tie the rope the rope then you just tie the string around you and it gives you that beautiful like v shape the material again is not the thickest but it is a beautiful ribbed stretchy material which to be honest is perfect for summer anyway because we don't want to be boiling hot I know my boyfriend is going to hate these but I really think they're a vibe. If you told me like six months ago I'd be wearing these, I'd have said no, not a chance. But I'm really enjoying the vibe of these. Of course, they are in a gorgeous brown color that we are all still very much loving. They're kind of just straight all the way down, to be honest with you. So we'll have to see what they look like on. I think it's kind of a good way of making this top quite casual if you pair them with these. And of course, the string is kind of like tying together, if that makes sense. Okay, so this is the first outfit with the, the top, obviously, and the brown trousers. Now, I looked on the website and this is how you're meant to tie them. And if you pull these two strings here, then it actually ruches at the front, which is very flattering, in my opinion especially if you're going to be eating a lot. I know I'm going to be eating and drinking a lot when I go to the pub, so kind of plain and simple at the back, but party definitely in the front, like, wow. To be honest, I do really like them. They are, I don't want to show my feet, they are like this at the bottom. They're not flared, they're very much straight. Definitely do really like this though, and it is pretty much bang on trend as well. Now for the next outfit, I just had to grab some more Marvel print. This is the specific top I picked up, which is absolutely stunning. I really, really do like this print and this pattern. I know it's most definitely not for everyone. It's kind of quite loud and in your face, but I just love the whole vibe of it. If you've watched some of my previous videos, you'll know that in one video I called it swirly print, but now I obviously know it's called marble print, but Either way, I'm here for it. Can't wait to see this on. Of course, I probably would have preferred it if it was cropped because it is more or less a full length top. It's got the beautiful lettuce detailing along the top and also on the sleeves as well. But yeah, this is super cute. It is meshy, so make sure you wear like a comfortable bra or bikini top underneath. It depends where you're going, but we love her. She's a vibe. To be honest, this actually would look like a bodysuit if you styled it with some like high-waisted trousers or something like that. That's probably the vibe I'm gonna go for with this and I'm obsessed. 
are you surprised? If you've been around my channel for a while, you know I love anything leather, whether it's a leather blazer, a leather jacket, a leather trouser. So you won't be surprised to see that I've picked up yet another pair of leather trousers. But I assure you, these are quite different to ones I've previously owned. They have belt loops, which is a massive, massive thing for me. You all know I love belt loops because trousers don't always fit the best on my waist. The way you would get these on is actually by this little zip at the side, which I think is super, super handy because then you're not gonna stretch the waist or anything like that. They have some lovely cargo pocket detailing at the side as well, which I'm really here for. And overall, as an outfit, I think this is gonna look great. Who would have guessed that I had a monochromatic outfit in a haul? Wow, this is gonna be a great haul because I'm honestly obsessed with both the outfits I've tried on already. Now, these leather trousers have got to be one of the best pairs I've ever tried on. Even though they have belt loops, as I showed you, they fit me so well. Can you see that? Amazing. So I honestly think the zip at the side has a massive part to play in that. They literally fit incredible. The length is great. I mean, obviously I'm sticking my leg up, so they've ridden up a bit, but when I'm stood like on the ground normally, they are kind of almost touching the floor, but not quite. They're like about two inches off the floor. So I could wear heels with them or I could wear flats with them and it would look amazing. The top, don't even get me started because I'm obsessed with. This is dreamy. Like I'm hooked i'm obsessed i'm in love can we take a minute for this outfit so yeah this is kind of like a dressy one to be honest but you could dress it down to wear it shopping or something like that this is more of like a bar night out outfit like drinks night out in my opinion for me like that's why i would wear it because you'd easily chuck on a pair of heels and it would look bomb it's also very covered like everything right now is covered like yes i'm wearing a bit of mesh but Especially at night, you're just not going to see anything whatsoever. So if you're looking for something like sexy while still being covered, this is definitely a good option for you. Okay, I clearly had Ibiza on my mind when I did this haul because I've got two three-piece bikinis to show you. And this is the first one. I also watch Faith Woodall and I've got her on Instagram as well. And I've got to say, she is literally the festival outfit queen i think that's fair to say anyway she made a reel about what she types in to find festival clothes and one of the things was three-piece bikinis and she's done me good on this one it's one of those tops that you just can't really figure out until you've got it on but anyway you've got a white bikini top i'm not sure how it goes on yet let's be honest but just wait till the try on clip and you'll see i believe it's one of those tie front tops kind of similar to what i've got on now but just in, in a bikini style. Let's just wait till the try and clip, shall we? Anywho, it's then got these quite simple, plain white thong bikini. That is the back, Jess. No, this is the back. These are quite skimpy, I will give you that, but we've got a little skirt to go with it, so you can be covered if you want as well. Alternatively, you can just chuck the skirt off and jump straight into a pool. This is going to sit quite high on your waist anyway, which is very flattering in my opinion. Very flattering on my particular body shape anyway and again it's one thing I look for when I'm shopping for bikinis then we've got this teeny tiny little skirt as well now I kind of had in mind that I was going to wear this to studio 338 when they open for like raves and stuff which you most definitely still could I don't know if it's going to be too skimpy for me I might swap out the top for something like this and maybe a slightly more substantial skirt but I'm not sure yet. You could kind of get away with anything at raves, if I'm honest. So we'll see about that. But it is basically just a little string skirt with a slit at the side and it ties at the side as well. So we'll see what this looks like on. I'll kind of tell you how much coverage there is or there isn't. Okay, so bear with me on this one. Just let's imagine I'm at Ocean Beach or at a beach club on the beach. It's not the most flattering, I won't lie to you. I had high hopes than expected for this. I had high hopes than expected. I expected this to be better. I'm not sure if I just got it a size too small. Not on the top bit, but like the skirt is just really, really short. Like 
my hopes to wear this to 338 are gone because like my bum would be out like the entire time but it just doesn't give me that much like shape like everything else that I've tried on I've absolutely loved but this just doesn't give me like Body. do you know what I mean? Next we actually have another kind of crisscross halter neck front top. If look how it's come. It's basically a few bits of fabric. It looks like a scarf if I'm honest. You see? So I'm not sure how we're gonna put this on and I really can't show you what it looks like until we've got it on so fast forward to when I've got it on and how I'm gonna style it another one i absolutely love so it's kind of similar to the first one and there's like crisscrossy halter necky but and this as well like you can wear in so many different ways like i think the model had it on like this but you could also put it down to make it look more like a bodysuit um like that and i love this like it's so summery it's so like vibey and just fashionable isn't it you can also be like as covered as you want so I'd probably wear it like this just because I get nervous but if you wanted to you could wear it like that completely depends it's completely up to you I can see myself wearing this a lot to be honest same with the white one just looks like that so it's really nice and backless again I've just paired it with the same black leather trousers as you saw earlier on in the try on anyway compared to what this looked like when I was just showing you i was like mm, is it gonna be a vibe or not it's, it's a vibe in my opinion the next thing i won't lie to you it's a completely different vibe but this would be so nice for either a girly brunch or pub gardens or like a picnic this is definitely a picnic outfit so i picked up this mint green little dress it's got a gorgeous sweetheart neckline it's got a bit of a cutout here as well so it's not like too young looking if that makes sense i really really like this the quality is actually unreal it is definitely double if not triple lines and it's got a nice zip at the back too so we're not going to be breaking her when we put it on i know for me i needed a lot more kind of spring summer dresses so as soon as i saw this and it was like a beautiful little mint teal color it's definitely coming up lighter on camera than it is in person that being said either way i just love the color even if it's just for a day out with your family like i would happily wear this to a zoo or as i said on a picnic anything kind of outdoorsy this would look super super cute too so yeah this is definitely a winner for me providing it fits but obviously you're going to see that I just think it's really cute and of course it's not too long either you know so that's that one i mean this is just a prime example of me not being able to pick my aesthetic as patricia bright would say this is a little girl in the prairie kind of outfit it's kind of like i do really like it to be honest with you kind of just screams like I'm an innocent little flower but I'm still stylish because you've got the little bit of satin satin going on here it's off the shoulder so you've got your clavicle out um but you're still really cute and presentable and I look naked <laughs> I love it next we have a very cute little cow neck top Again, it's got beautiful bluey orangey hues, which is so nice for summer and spring. It's a really cute cowl top. It has this beautiful lace up detailing at the back as well. And I really love it. I really, really love it. It looks kind of satiny. Well, I guess it feels satiny as well, but it's not your conventional kind of silky soft, oh poly kind of satin, but then you can't really expect that from Shein, can you? This you could honestly style in so many different ways. I see myself wearing this on like a girly drinks night at the pub or at a bar, either with jeans or leather trousers or probably just jeans or leather trousers if I'm honest with you. But it is definitely a cute jeans and a nice top kind of fit. Okay, this is cute as it is. I mean, I would just wanna like tuck it in like that because that's how I find these cow neck tops like the most flattering. But wait till you see the back. 
just such a winner for me again like sorry to pick myself up but i actually outdone myself with this haul like everything fits so well so far anyway so far and it's all beautiful and let me just add as well this entire thing like this entire haul costs 100 pounds and i've got so many so many outfits okay going back to that beautiful marble print because we already know i had to include another piece in here again it's meshy i didn't realize it was mesh when i ordered it i won't lie to you but it is mesh but the material is so soft i honestly wish you could feel it it literally feels like silk on your skin so i've not even tried it on yet and i can literally can already tell you that it's got this o-ring detailing at the front so you can have a bit of cleave out if you've got cleave i mean i don't it is long sleeved so i think it will be good for spring as well even though it is slightly colder at the moment you are going to be more or less covered wearing this Again, you can style this in a whole bunch of different ways, whether that be with leather trousers or jeans. I just think, again, it's a nice jeans and a top number. I'm liking it, but I'm not loving it. It's this top here. I've paired it with my Zara jeans. Like, it's nice, but it's not, like doesn't slap as much as the black one like it's not blowing me away i do like the o-ring detailing but like is it meant to go here or is it meant to go here or like down there do you know what i mean so i'm not like wow by this it's still nice but i'm just like i think everything else in the haul so far has just been so nice that i'm almost a bit let down by this one sorry and finally we have another bikini to show you again it's a three-piece set this one is completely different to the other one it's kind of like a bikini triangle top and some shorts and a bikini bottom as well now can we just this screams festival to me i mean i personally think you will look so cool in a crowd with your little flame bikini set on again it's not 100% my style but I thought I'd show it anyway because I mean I probably would wear it to a festival if I'm honest I mean maybe I'll wear it to park life who knows of course it's got the matching kind of it's not actually thong it's more of a Brazilian but it's got the matching bikini bottoms as well these are definitely a lot smaller than the others and they're also a little bit skimpier as well so and then this is what makes it in my opinion the mesh shorts now i'm sorry i think these are so cool if you were that kind of blonde bombshell cool girl definitely not me that could pull these off then i envy you because i think this is incredible I'm not sure whether i'm going to be brave enough to wear it yet but i'm going to keep it in my wardrobe just in case i just think you'll look like the coolest coolest bitch on the block if you wear these as predicted i don't feel cool enough to wear this like flames outfit but my god, does it make me feel like a baddie? Like, let me show you. I love it. The only thing I will say is size up. The shorts fit me really, really nicely, but the bikini itself is tiny. Absolutely tiny. I really can't decide whether to keep this or not just because I wouldn't be able to wear the bikini on its own. Like, I can wear the top and it's fine, but... The bottoms are just like they're literally digging into my love handles right now and let's call them hips they're digging into my hips and it's just not it just, like, it just doesn't suit me right so i kind of wish i'd got a medium even though like, i am a size six usually for reference and i got a small so yeah bear that in mind right boys and girls that is more or less everything i have to show you in this haul I really hope you've enjoyed. I personally love literally everything I picked up and I'm gonna struggle to send anything back whatsoever. If you have enjoyed, please don't forget to like and subscribe. It would really help me grow and I would love to see more familiar faces around here. But without keeping you on for too long, thank you so much for watching and I will see you in my next video. Bye.